Tanya Barnett here. I hope you guys had a great holiday. Um, I just want to do a quick video and pose a question to you guys because there's been some stuff coming up recently that kind of made me start thinking about it myself. And you know, in the past I've done a few videos called Interview Your Agent uh, where I recommended different questions to ask during the interview process when you're choosing your realtor to make sure you pick the one that best works for you. Um, and since that happened, I actually lost a listing uh, to another agent and you know I had worked hard to build a relationship with that person and and basically tell that person you know what I could do to help market their property and so I reached out to the seller who happened to email me on Christmas Day to let me know that they were listing with somebody else and um, you know she was kind about it and when I asked her what made her choose a different agent she simply said that that person uh, they saw their name up around their neighborhood a lot and so they thought they knew the neighborhood well and um, you know that was kind of eye-opening for me and it made me think about a lot of the years I've been in real estate that I've seen that and that's kind of been um, something that holds true for a lot of buyers and sellers where they just pick the realtor because they see their name a lot so I just wanted to pose this question to you and see what it is that makes you choose your realtor. Um, you know, it's just having their signs in the neighborhood good enough for you. Is that kind of a testimony to their ability to buy or sell houses? Or do you dig deeper than that? You know, I think that, uh, I don't want to talk bad about fellow realtors, but I think that a lot of realtors kind of get away with, you know, you see their name, so you hire them and you expect things from them, but what actual work are they putting out? Uh, so I just wanted to hear from you guys and see what you guys think um, you know, we as realtors can do to kind of set ourselves apart in the community and work better for our clients. And, you know, maybe what I could have done better to where I didn't lose that opportunity with that seller just based on her seeing a different name um, and not basing it on my professionalism and my, you know, hard work. So anyway, I hope you guys are having a great day out there. And uh, if you get a chance, just leave me a comment and let me know what you think. Thank you. Bye.